Hi, today I am going to make Christmas bells or Sandazonia, a really pretty, very cute flower. Material required are crepe papers in orange, white, green, a green floral tape, yellow color acrylics, acrylic color, a thin wire, and a thick wire. The stencils and measurements are given at the end of video. Take the thin wire, measure about 4 inches on it, cut this piece out. Now take the, I have cut a strip from the green paper, so about half a centimeter wide, so cut it and stretch it. Apply glue on it. And wind this on the wire. tightly. Now take the small piece white in color and take some acrylic paint yellow color and just paint the edge. About one millimeter wide on both sides and leave it to dry. After it has dried, make fine slits on it, about half a centimeter long. Then curl the stamen like this. Apply glue on the base. And wind this on the wire that we prepared. So this is what it looks like. Now take the strip for the flower. First on one side make scallops. Like this, and then with the scissors only you can just sort of score lines on it about five six lines, like this, and then on the side where you made the uh, lines, so just turn it over and curl the paper. Just the scallops, like so, and then bend them. Each scallop, just bend it on the top. So you get a shape like this. Then turn the paper around, and leaving about half a uh, centimeter on the top, just stretch the paper as much as you can without tearing it this is what it looks like apply glue on one edge and towards the scalloped edge apply it at a slant
like so and then just stick the other side on it so this is what it looks like now turn it over apply glue on the top you can apply dabs of glue on the inside of the flower like that take the stamen that we prepared put it inside and where the stamen ends just there stick the edges you stick the folds also just there now holding the bottom so that it sticks take a pencil the base of the pencil and push the paper out like that then just press it from the top and count to like 10 so that it sort of holds the shape and leave it and this is the fly you get for the leaves first with scissors or any blunt object just score lines on it like this and then just give it one curl like so so do this with all the leaves so this is how they all look I've made about 8-9 flowers and all the leaves now take the green floral tape and cut out a long piece and stretch it Now take the thick wire, first start winding on the top, on one end of the wire, just one whirl or so, so that it sticks. Now take the small leaves and attach them. Then take another one and attach it maybe opposite to each other. The leaves are, you know, they're not, uh, they're alternate also and they're very close together. Oops. And if this happens that you break your tape, so you start again. So attach all, I make, I put four leaves, four smaller ones. Maybe attach one big leaf. Then take one flower, put it on the stem, about two inches of the stem should be there and then put a leaf also right behind the stem of the flower. Wind it. Then on maybe on a different position, put another flower, another leaf. So all flowers have a leaf behind it. So 
continue attaching flowers like this a flower and go lower as you go down just put the flowers a little lower than the other the previous one and all around the stem so you don't have to be particular which direction you have to put no, nothing like that so attach all the flowers this way this is how it will look now just bend the flowers down facing downwards And that's how it gets its name as Christmas lantern or Christmas bells because it does look like that and then pull down the leaves also a bit This is how the finished stem would look. All the measurements are in centimeter. This is for our stamen. This is 2 centimeter high and 1 centimeter wide. Cut one piece per flower. This is of the flower. This is 3.5 centimeter high and 5 centimeter wide. Cut one piece. And these are of the leaves. The small leaf is 8 centimeter long and 1 cm by 1 cm is a stem the width of the leaf is 1.5 cm and the bigger leaf is 11.5 cm high and 2 cm wide the stem is 1.5 by 1 cm so you need to cut 3-4 pieces of the small leaf and 1 piece at least of uh, the big leaf per flower 